What is up you guys? It is Watermelon here with episode 5 of my Drug City playthrough. And we're doing pretty good. This is another inventory of sugarcane. Um, off camera I filled up this chest, this chest, this chest, this chest, this chest, this chest, <laughs> this chest this chest, this one, this one, that one, and I need 18 stacks and I'll have filled up this one. Then we get to convert it all into paper so that I can sell it. So let's go ahead and grab 18 stacks. Um, 37, so across and back. And then one missing. Why is my inventory all laggy? I have one missing so that the last stack comes in my hotbar. And I get like six or seven stacks per row now, which is really nice, um, because my herbalism is such a high level that it just double drops like crazy. It just hit 316. Um, and that's only with like four or five harvests, which is pretty cool. I think this is my fifth harvest, um, the one I'm doing right now which is really nice. At first, um, each row would give me four stacks per row if I didn't have herbalism leveling, or leveled so high. Um, so I'm getting, like, really good double drops. And hopefully I'll be able to get herbalism up to a thousand sometimes so that I get double drops all the time. That'll probably actually be sometime this week. Um, which is good, because then I can do pumpkin farms and make bank, so let's just get this last stack. And I don't have to worry about, like, leaving parts of it unharvested, because it grows really fast, and, like, by the time I finish harvesting this floor, the upstairs is grown, and by the time I ha finish harvesting it, the downstairs is grown, so it's really like a non-stop harvesting process. Um, and that's why I called it a plantation as the title of my last video. Because it's like a freaking plantation. Um, I just broke, there it is. Alright, so let's throw this upstairs and then we can start converting 18 large chests of sugar cane into paper so that we can sell it. I don't talk soft. That's that other guy. I'm screaming, what the fuck is that bug? I can't see this guy. And shit, I'm doing this year. Insanity. Made the beat, then murdered it. Casey Anthony. Three. Maybe. I'm so close to done. Got one more inventory. First paper on your own. Alright, last inventory y'all, and then it's time to sell. 18 chests. It's like 900,000 worth of paper. Only if paper was worth this much in real life. Well, actually, no, I wouldn't like that, because I don't have like a giant paper mill. So then it would cost a lot of money to get paper for school, so maybe I guess that would be a bad thing. <sighs> so close. So 
So it's time to sell. Let's start here, and we will work our ways. All right. See, look, I'm literally making paper right now. Well, I finished making paper. So that's funny. So actually, while I was in the middle of it, um, I, my dad called me to tell me. I don't know why I'm running up water. My dad called me to tell me that um, he was a J.C. Penny, and he heard the lady on the escalator in front of her, or in front of him, tell his or her daughter that um, she was exhausting and it was like going to the mall with a chihuahua, and that's hilarious. And then I think I will convert my farm to um, pumpkins. It's so much easier to convert and sell, but it's actually less money. Like. It's half as much money. Literally. Like half as much money. But it's, they grow relatively fast. The conversion takes less time. And they can grow more in the same amount of space. So. And I'm actually gonna have to like look into that. About like how much it, um. Costs. Or not how much it costs, but like space efficiency and stuff to like get this like downbeat, like which is the best. Because um, it's between paper and pumpkin seeds. Wheat's probably the best, but um, it's really like a pain to do because to make it the best and most efficient, you have to like actively go and harvest. Like, you have to actively harvest, and like, when one grows, you gotta get it right away. You can't do it all at once, like I do with the sugar cane. Um, so, it's actively working versus just harvesting for a couple hours and then converting and feeling rewarded after grinding all day when you get a rank up. And that's actually why I like servers like this because you spend hours on end working at something and then you get the reward in the end, um, and to me that's really good. Some people don't exactly like it, which is why they might not necessarily play servers like this. Um, but for me that's what Minecraft is, it's like grind, 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 and then you get rewarded. Like you go branch mining and it's like grinding, 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 oh my gosh. And right when you want to tear your hair out you find diamonds. Um, except diamonds are actually like pretty common. It doesn't take that long to find them. Um, but like it used to be like when you first start playing, you're like, oh my gosh, I found diamonds. Like you spend an hour and a half caving and then you find them and you're just like, yes. Um, and that's kind of what this is like. It's like you spend, see, I've been working on here since nine o'clock this morning. So it's 2.30. You spend your whole day working on it and then you get rewarded. Um, so tomorrow I should hopefully be able to get to Legacy, um, obviously today I'm not, just because I'm, or if I do get the money for it, I'm not going to actually rank up just because I want to do it on the video, and obviously I'm recording the video now, and I don't know if I will get to it or not, and I want to be able to have a video up, so that's going to be what happens. And my videos are going to be longer now. I'm thinking 15 to 20 minutes will be a good time. Because um, that helps me because it's like letting down my barriers. Because like I'm really like, I don't want to say shy. Just because like when I meet somebody new, like I'm not just right away like, Yo, what's up? You my new friend. I'm like shy at first. And then after like a couple days or maybe a week or so, like once I get to know people, then I'm like a lot more open and funny and stuff. And that's kind of what it is with this. Because the first couple of videos I'm going to be like really quiet and stuff and as I open up y'all are going to be like, man, I don't like this guy, he's so annoying. I can do it. I can do it. I can do it. Uh, home sky block. Home sky block. Okay, man, all my sugar cane on there is all messed up. I'm just getting lazy with my clicking. And we are now filthy rich, bell top. I am rank number three. Ranked three, bell top. 
Let's find out what I'm getting while I get it. Here we go. Kingpin. Three set hems slash craft. That's actually like awesome. Alright guys, thanks for checking out my most productive video thus far where I made money. I am now a kingpin. I still got 600,000 so I'm about 2 million away from ranking up. Um, so I'll hopefully be able to rank up in tomorrow's video. Um, it's time for me to go pee. So peace out y'all.